The test speeds can be used for testing the system operation, sample practicing, and troubleshooting. The procedure for counting beads and cells are the same, except the beads are ready to use and require no dilution. They are also within the test diameter and concentration range of the device. If beads are refrigerated, allow it to come to room temperature and mix gently but thoroughly using low-level vortex pulsing or hand mixing up to 50 times. Sample directly from the bottle or transfer at least 100 microliter per sensor test into a 1.5 mil microcentrifuge tube. Either the 40 or 60 micron sensor can be used for this test. To get started on the Scepter 3.0 instrument, we'll first turn on Make sure it's charged, set up the time, date, and gating options. If not charged, place on the charging station for up to three hours for a full charge. Set the time and date by scrolling from the main menu, arrows, and OK buttons accordingly. The test files are created and named using these timestamps. For first usage, set to auto gating. The user can decide whether to continue to gate using auto gating or change to use last for similar sample runs. Select menu, gating, and scroll to auto gating. Hit OK and return to main menu. Making sure that both the instrument and screen and sensor stamp size are facing you, gently but firmly insert the sensor into the sensor port of the Scepter 3.0 instrument. Push the sensor until the sensor stop wings meet the instrument. If properly inserted, the Scepter 3.0 will begin characterizing the sensor step on the display screen. The screen will indicate submerge the sensor, then press OK to begin counting. Once the test sample is mixed well, open sample lid and insert the sensor tip to the bottom of the tube, making sure it's not resting on the bottom, and press OK to start test. Once the beep is heard, the sample has been drawn and you can remove the sensor tip from the solution. Pause while the sample volume travels through the microfluidic channels to the sensing zone and finally to the stop chamber. Once prompted, eject the sensor tip from the Scepter 3.0 instrument. The display shows the latest sample data histogram. Refer to the test B container label for expected concentration and diameter. Press the OK to return to the main menu or adjust the gating by selecting the menu button and go to the edit analysis.